guys, it's me again. Um, and this video was honestly supposed to be the first video I did when I came back, but I felt like other videos were more interesting to make for the first day I was back. Um, but yeah, um, I, I wanted to give my review of my second semester in grad school slash first full year. Um, and I, I have to say this semester, I've already explained that all of my classes are dialogues, conversations through the Socratic method. We do it all virtually. Obviously I'm in a chair, so that helps. I can't travel all that far. Um, but yeah, anyway, um, This semester was definitely an experience for sure. I, I, there are segments to the curriculum. It's a liberal arts curriculum, and there are segments to the curriculum. And um, they originally wanted to put me in the literature one. Um, or I think I had requested that, but they put me in the politics and society one. And honestly, I was bummed out because I wanted to do um no 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 I'm misremembering I was in philosophy and theology I was bummed out because I wanted to do that segment um but they switched me because they mismanaged things anyway but it turned out to be a blessing in disguise because um the politics and society one um segment of the curriculum was well, really great like I learned a lot like um you know we started with Aristotle and Plato the Republic and Nicomachean ethics and um yeah they just do a great job of showing you the history of laws and of political society and of government um in early Greek times to around about 1970, 1980, we ended with Hannah Arendt's On the Origins of Totalitarianism, and I'll make a video about that, um, it's probably gonna be a companion to my video on, on, uh, alienation. Um, but yeah, anyway, um, I feel like I have a good grounding of how Western governments work now and how they've developed in their history. And so it was a blessing in disguise. The only thing is, is that I've started to notice things about the academic culture that sort of bother me a little bit. Now, there are things I can improve, like... Um, there are really no grades, at least no outward facing grades, um, and so everything is just super detailed criticisms on each of your essays. That's the only assignments we have are essays, and, um, yeah, bro, one of my essays, um, about the the contemplative and the divine in Aristotle's Nicomachean ethics was completely demolished, bros. I got destroyed. Um, and honestly, I didn't take it well at all. And, but me and the professor patched it up eventually, right? We squashed that beef. Um, and so, yeah, that's certainly something I need to learn better. I need to learn how to take criticism of my work better. It's just because, I mean, in all other aspects of my life, I don't really care because I'm mediocre in them. But I'm very, very, very particular about my work. And I'm very proud of my work. Because um, it's the only thing I have. My brain... 
my writing skills are the only thing that I have, so, but any, anyway, um, I still felt, though, that there were definitely, like, there's this air of elitism and stuff like that, when I first got the mostly negative feedback back, um, in one of the exchanges, I asked, like, am I going to fail because of this, and it, and, my professor was like, oh, no, you shouldn't say it because of that. And I'm like, but, bro, you have to understand, like, I'm on a scholarship. I'm doing this because, like, I eventually want to get some type of job. Um, and so, but the thing is, the instructors, the professors don't really understand that. Like, we're not all rich white people bros like <laughs> like my family is solidly lower middle class for sure and honestly i've i've gone without debt through school because of scholarships and because of things like fafsa so i mean i'm i'm not rich so i thought that was kind of arrogant of him uh, for sure I'm not saying I was a spring chicken I wasn't but yeah for sure um there's just so much elitism where I go it's a, it's very much a conservative school I like the curriculum but the the staff is very very much arrogant and very very much not really that down to earth um all right that was my review of my first full year and second semester at my grad school bye, bye.